Hello everybody, uh, I have here a, a new computer to, to play with. This is a Timex in class 268 and uh, the problem with this computer is the video output is very noisy, it's almost uh, useless. Uh, I can't believe that they actually chipped this, this machine with this quality of video. So looking here inside, it's a little dark. Uh, I did a mod as it's uh, uh, you can find on the internet. You replace the the power source for the for the video chip. You get the the, the power from this uh, resistor here and use a 7805 to regulate the voltage to five volts. This this gives a a better video. At least you you don't have this uh, lots of noise as usually, but still has noticeable uh, noise, especially if you go for the for co uh, all sixteen colors. You see the magenta is, is really, and the, the lines here they're very wobbling lines. But if you play a game like Altered Beast that has a, a checkerboard pattern, you see how bad it is. Can you see those waving line, those lines? Yeah, this makes the video very, very disturbing. So what I did is this computer has an RGB output, um, but still the, the sync video is it has all this noise. So what I did is I plugged them into the uh, RGB to VGA um, using a little uh, converter here. I changed some some pins. I'm um, inputting the green through the bright channel and uh, because I need to listen to the composite sync and the result is let me put on the PC input the result is that you have the board already running in 860 806 by 600 pixels you have very sharp let's play the game we have scale lines simulated scale lines let's play Rise from your grave. Yeah, I will not be playing this game. This Timex has the Spectrum ROM using it because I cannot run the DVMMC from the Timex ROM. It's very bright. But if you play, unfortunately, it does not output the the bright channel. So I can have only eight colors, but they are pretty pretty stable and and, and sharp. Um, I can show you the. Sixty four column output. Now it's in sixty four columns, but uh, since the memory is odd, even mapped, it still jumps one character each. But you can see by the size of the character that it's indeed sixty four column mode, which is pretty sharp and neat. 
Uh, and that's it. Uh, I'm not sure that this code, because it runs a custom code now for, for the for the RGB to VGA, if it will ever run on other machines, if they have exactly the same problem or not. Uh, but yeah, there's a possibility, an alternative to have a a pretty sharp and neat uh, video. Uh, as last thing I'll show uh, come on game let's get the 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 crest which is nice the crest Playing with one hand is very hard to do. So that's it. I uh, have a usable output for my Timex Singler now. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.